name is Fonkel Dolly. I am a Dubai based Cameroonian YouTuber. I film random videos on skincare, lifestyle, makeup, DIY, you name it. And today we are going to be doing the husband tag. Yay! I'm super excited. <laughs> I have my husband right here. Uh, babe, do you want to say hi to my lovely subscribers? Hello, guys. Uh, do you want to tell them what your name is or do you want me to? Really? I thought you were going to do the introduction. <laughs> okay, my name is Emilio, Emilio Guerino, so this is Mrs. Guerino. Okay. Yeah. Okay. My first time being in front of the camera, so I'm very nervous. <laughs> it's okay. At least he gets to, to experience what it feels like. So. I'm not even breathing well. <laughs> <laughs> Just breathe, relax. Okay, um, so I found a couple of questions to do this husband tap with. So, um, let's jump right into it. Are you ready? Not really. Yes, Come on. I'm ready. Okay, yeah. cool. <laughs> so first <coughs> question. How did we meet? How like the first time ever? Yeah, how did we meet? I met met this beautiful lady in back when she was in the university, yeah. At a friend's place, a very close friend. Yeah. And we had this said two words and I was like, Yeah, I need to speak to this girl and everything. So she left and I traced the house, it was not night, you won't believe it, I traced the house that night and I invited her out and luckily for me she accepted to go with me, so that's how we began. No, wait a minute, did you not, you used to tell me this crazy story that the first time you saw me at Tina's house, you were like, so this is the person, she's not that beautiful or which, I'm not first, first time. Oh, that was the first time, but I heard Tina spoke about you earlier. Yeah. yeah. Tina used to always say, ah, this, I have this beautiful sister, you know, and yeah, at first I was not really impressed, like, Tina overpraised her and everything, yeah, <laughs> that's what I thought initially, maybe I was blind. Okay, that's reassuring. Okay, uh, how long have you guys been together? Um, marriage, one year, but taking marriage out. That's like from 2005 years. Have we been dating for five, five years? Five years. And if you take the on and off time, you know, so it's going to cut down to maybe three years somewhere there. I don't know. Okay. Oh, he said um, we'll be married for a year because August is our anniversary actually. Yay. Um, <sighs> marriage is not a walk in the park. Jeez. <laughs> Do you guys argue um, about the most? Mm, we argue on so many things. I can't even remember. Like which, which one? The most? The most? Mm. Mm, about who's going to organize the house? Okay. Yeah. And the cooking? <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I think. Okay. That's it. In the relation, in the in the marriage or relationship. Who wears the pants? Uh, I think I do. Really? Yeah, but you know, women have the ways of getting things done. So. I think it depends on which domain the marriage. In the kitchen, I wear the pants. Everybody has in the organization and everything. You wear the pants, but like, I mean, pants, pants, decisions, and everything. We talk about it, and then yeah, but I mean, I trust you. You always have my back. So. Yeah. So coming back to I wear the pants. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Um. Did you know he was the one when you first met? Did you know I was the one when you first met me? Um. It was a fifty-fifty thing. I knew I wanted to settle down. I knew, yeah. I was the point. I was at this point where yeah, I needed to be. Mm -hmm stable and everything yeah and i met this beautiful girl her looks were extraordinary <laughs> i did not know about her character sincerely <laughs> yeah but that's what attracted me first then yeah i took the first step then got to know her and her character was amazing there were, there were some flaws you know some opportunities for growth but yeah okay so i knew she was the one what is your ethnicity? My ethnicity... I'm a Cameroonian. Yeah. But my mom is Cameroonian and my dad is Spanish. But I love identifying with Cameroon because I grew up with my mom and I grew up in Cameroon. So the food I like is Cameroon. My best meal is Eru. So <laughs> I'm not the pizza kind of guy. So and I love pasta. Aero comes first. Okay, I'm Cameroonian, of course. No, I'm not mixed or anything. Uh, what does he think about you doing YouTube? What do you think about 
when she's happy, then you need to do what makes her happy. Yeah. What's your favorite thing to do together? Favorite thing to do together? Uh -huh. uh, go walking. Yeah, when we go out. Yeah. I'm an, I'm an, um, she loves outdoors a lot. Yeah, so. me is an um, introvert, I'm an extrovert. Left to me, I'm going to be indoors every day. Mm -hmm. no. But she loves walking, so yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, it's really a nice atmosphere. Okay. Um, what do you love most about each other? What I love most about her is she's very open, you know. She doesn't keep things for long. She's straight to the point. She tells you, like, you've done this and don't do that. Yeah, it makes things easier. Okay. Um, what I like about you is... It's your simple nature. I mean, I'm, I, I'm into clothes, shoes, makeup, all of these things. And with him, he doesn't mind having two t-shirts. I'm like, I had a panic attack when I lost my bag when I moved to Dubai, like earlier this year. He was like, it's okay, you will be fine. You know, I just like um, his simple way of life. He does not complicate anything. A watch is a watch. It doesn't have to be a Rolex. I'm like, hello. I mean, there's a difference between a Rolex and a watch, and uh, a regular to watch. To read the time. <laughs> yeah, that's one thing I really like about him. Like, two opposites attract each other, and that's definitely our case. Like, we are very different about a lot of things, and I appreciate his um, simple personality like that. So, next question. What does the other person do that annoys you the most? Um, yeah... over and over even when I tell her I don't like when you've done this it looks like she has this forgetful memory you tell her one second I didn't like this would you not do it again and the next day or oh, that's if you're lucky maybe in the next 30 minutes you find her doing the same thing again so really it just it gets me so annoyed I'm working on it I'm working on it yeah I'm working on it Okay, um, how long have you been married for? It's almost a year now. Yeah. yeah. Uh, just maybe, maybe two to three weeks. We may go a year. Yeah, who knows? I, yeah. I may, I, I'm still to decide. I may put up a small clip of, uh, well, it was the, the smallest um, civil wedding um, in the world. Yeah, so I may put up a clip in another video we'll see how it goes yeah so what's your favorite memory together so far i think it's the honeymoon oh really the honeymoon was nice yeah yeah so, we went to this town we've never been there before we went to kribi i've never been to kribi yeah I yeah see. and you won't believe it it's supposed to be a honeymoon but we spent i think the the first two hours searching for a hotel yeah. we didn't know any place in town, mm -hmm. nobody to guide us, and we just kept going round and round and round. Mm -hmm. Then we finally settled at one hotel. It was not even the hotel we booked, so we just slept there for the night. Then we saw ourselves the next day. But Kribi was an amazing experience. It yeah, was, it was great. Um, my favorite memory. It would have to be our first date. For some reason, I never ever forgot. As in first proper date, you know. The effort he put into it, like, I don't know if I have to tell this story another, in another video, or, but long story short, he took me to this place. If you're from Cameroon, if you know Douala, and if you love seafood, you know Tonton Sami. You know, I was surprised. The effort he put into it, we went to Tonton Sami, you know. Yeah, we, and he do research. We, 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 he takes me there. I am, um, okay, I go there. I'm like, okay, how much is the fish? And the guy is like, Fifteen thousand. I'm like for what? Where? Which fish? He, and after he had said fifteen thousand, there were other clients, so he was not even paying attention to me no more. I looked at him, and he was like, "It's fine. Just take whatever you want." I'm like, mm, "Really? What?" It's a lie. I couldn't believe he was telling me to just take whatever I want and everything. You know, I didn't want to come across as, "Hmm, you get it." And then he chooses his own fish, and he takes salt. If you know salt, salt is an expensive fish. 
And I hear the guy saying, uh, uh, La Sol say, descent meal or something like that. I was like, what? His own fish is way more expensive than mine. Oh, <laughs> I went right ahead, chose the bad fish I wanted um, from the start. Trust me, I've never recovered from that price till date, like 17,000 for his fish, 15,000 for mine. Because the drinks are not inclusive and everything, but overall it was an amazing first day. I mean, very chill. The place was really nice, quiet, very mature. I was like, hmm, this guy, he knows what he's doing. He's done anyway, his research about me. <laughs> that's what happens when you're prepared. You know, you get to know the person you want to go out with. I know she, she likes seafood, you know, Maybe a bouquet of flowers won't impress her. Yeah, so. I mean, get me a pair of loops or something. Okay. Yeah, so. Yeah, I got to put in some work to do some research, know what she likes and everything. Because there was no way I was going to miss this beautiful girl. So. Yeah. Oh, really? Okay, that's very sweet of you. Uh, where do you see yourself? Where do you see us in five years? Five years. Let's see us with um, many kids running around. What do you mean by many kids? Maybe six, seven kids. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going past two. No, maybe three. Two. Four. Two. Okay, let's settle on three. Two. Three it is. Yeah, so besides yeah. the kids. Besides the kids, I uh, see us having grown in our careers and Subscribers plus, I see. <laughs> us. <laughs> Please, the girl is allowed to drink by the grace of God. The own the house. I don't know, but I just speak growth every day in my life. You know, you have to speak it into existence. Who is crankier in the morning? Maybe me. <laughs> Who says sorry first? Yeah, I think it depends on the situation. But most of the times, she says sorry first, yeah, but I do, yeah. Yeah, I don't hold my sorry. So I'm sorry, thank you. Those are just things you should use um, in your day-to-day -day life. Throw ego aside. I mean, the person in front of you is much more important. Um, so that's it, guys. Um, we've come to the end of the husband tag. Um, I'm so happy to have done this time with my husband for you guys to get to meet him. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and when next will be coming up on my channel? Uh, I hope I'll be coming soon again but it's not easy sitting in front of the camera so I don't know. I, I'm so happy he even did he's very shy as a person. This is not really his thing. I prefer bringing behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh thank you. Thank you for doing it. Thank you. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to click the subscribe button uh, down below. And don't forget to thumbs up this video if you want to see the hops again. Uh, see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye-bye.